Welcome to History Adventuring. This is episode number 214. I'm Brad Hall, and today we're walking from Glendale to Peoria, Arizona. Yesterday I walked from Glendale, Arizona to Peoria, Arizona. They're two suburbs of Phoenix that originally were five miles apart. So if you know the Phoenix area and you know a little bit of its history, you would have been impressed if I told you that I walked from one little town to another 100 years ago. Yesterday, you wouldn't have been impressed because the two cities meet in the center of 67th Avenue. That is, when you walk across 67th Avenue, you start in Glendale. And when you get halfway, you're in Peoria. I've lived in Glendale for a long time, and I've even seen the Peoria police cars turn left while the Glendale police cars turn right. But make no mistake, if necessary, the two cities help each other out. It isn't as if the Glendale police would chase you to the city limits and stop. When I lived in Los Angeles, it was a crazy patchwork of little towns that had grown together. Just a few decades before I lived there, there were open spaces between the towns. But since these spaces have been gone for so long, it's hard to say the moment when you leave Van Nuys and enter Canoga Park, uh, for example. In fact, when I lived there, I heard someone say that it was very convenient that the city of Los Angeles had divided itself up like that. I guess if you don't know the history, it looks like that. Anyway, that's what happens with big cities. The towns that were once miles away grow to each other and touch. If I tried to walk from downtown Glendale, which is at 59th Avenue in Glendale, to downtown Peoria, which is at 83rd Avenue in Peoria, my little weak ankles would never make it. But going from the Glendale city limits to the Peoria city limits now means just crossing a street. Nothing much changes as I cross the street. My phone tells me that I'm no longer in Glendale, and I'm told that the city sales tax is different. I don't pay much attention to that kind of stuff. There's a Welcome to Peoria sign that I walk past on my way to get my coffee at McDonald's, but otherwise Peoria looks just like Glendale. But I get to say that I walk from one city to another just to get my morning coffee. This has been History Adventuring. I'll talk to you later.